Hello, hello everyone. Welcome to the Countdown Cuppa. It's a pre so chat. It doesn't make as much sense for the Sunday teacher. Anyway, it's a countdown show, pre show, show, show. And let me greet everyone. I hope you guys drink some delicious tea. But how, how are you doing? Alona and Jalen. Hello, um, Off Mao. How are you doing? Who else we got here? How, how are you doing, Dresnik? Commander Amphibian? Undersea Rexy, Judd, and don't worry about your drugs, Judd, they're fine. Bitsu, welcome to the stream. Mad Adder, Auto Mayfield, and all of the lurkers, welcome to the stream. Today, we are gonna be drinking, sampling 10 different teas. And, and because of Bitsu, I was able to switch over to a new system for my streams. I'll probably adjust it even more, but we are now on a blue screen instead of green screen. It doesn't really mean that much for you, but I do think it looks a lot better now. It's a pain to set up a cup of tea before you have a dozen cup of tea. That doesn't make much sense. I Maybe you guys are having your countdown cup and I'm just sitting here contemplating life. <laughs> oh my goodness gracious. Oh, by the way, I woke up at like 4 a.m. to get like some water. Oh, it's probably later that. I woke up at some time in the middle of the night and I walk up to my computer. And my computer, I just see computer rebooting. You know, like the, the BIOS splash screen? I was like, oh no. And then I went over, freaking Windows updated. I didn't tell it to update. And when it when it started, it's like, would you like to upgrade to Windows 11? I was like, no, I do not want to update, upgrade to Windows 11. I will say on Windows 10. <sighs> but yeah, I was worried it broke stuff, but luckily the, the rebooting of the computer and upgrade did not break anything. I don't think it did at least. Uh, he's scared you last I had to model about eyes. Well, uh, no, I can't toggle eyes on this model, but too. Uh, if you want to switch to my baby model, that one I can toggle the eyes on. Bro, I woke up at three to go to the bathroom, then woke up before go to the bathroom again. I mean, you, you probably, you're probably, uh, hydrated at the very least. <laughs> Got a lot of water in your system, it sounds like. Mm -hmm. Good to say hydrated. Oh, um, yeah. I spent like three hours last night, which I should not have done on a Saturday. So I didn't get the blue screen. Should not have done on a Saturday. Cause like, not the right choice. <laughs> oh, it's fine. I basically did that and then I caught up on a bunch of anime. I went to bed like five or 6 a.m. No, I guess I said, I don't know when I went to bed. I never get that much sleep on Sundays though. That's my Sunday. Sundays I never really get much sleep. But then on Sunday night, so like after stream, I do get a lot of sleep. But like Saturday to Sunday, I don't get much sleep. So you got four hours of sleep? Yeah, that's probably about as much I got. I probably got four hours. But that's just me on Sundays. I just like, I, I'm tired. I just stay awake with copious amount of tea. That's just me. Copious and copious amount of tea. And uh, Autumn Mayfield is saying you're playing Polly on Switch. Is that, what sort of game is that? Is that like a platformer? I don't have a Switch right now, so I've been keeping track of all the Switch releases. But I know there's a lot of good games on Switch. And I need to pick up, I need to, because I, I haven't played games on stream in a long time. Because I just moved to just doing these short streams. Got the bed at 10. That's a nice good hour. Uh, and Trustnik saying, I'm going to go eat uh, out with my class in a German class. My teacher going to pay for ourselves. But the last session, um, Less, less, less is tomorrow. Oh, you're almost out of school. You're hell. You have a great dinner or lunch with your um, your class. That sounds fun. And Commander Fabian, you were, Commander Fabian is saying that they're going to switch their profile picture, but you did not. It's okay. You can change your profile picture whenever you so desire. Maybe you'll do it next time. It's just fine. It's fine. Oh, so I'm going to take a sip of water. My throat's dry. Mmm. Delicious. I feel like I have every week. I feel like I have like 20 things I want to do and I get like 10 done, but that's still pretty good. Bro, bro turn to dough. Am I dough? Uh, am I money? Maybe. <laughs> oh gosh. So today's uh, stream essentially what it is every year. Uh, Liquiporous is a tea shop in the States. They do a thing where they send out samplers for real cheap for some shang and shoe pour i did notify my discord about it happening i don't know if anyone else in my community bought into it 
I do hope so. At least like one or two people did. But if not, next year it'll be a chance. It's something that they do every year. It's a really good way to get into, well, poor because you get some proper good quality ones. Because like if you go and try to, you know, try Shang and Shu T, you might not necessarily be able to get good ones for cheap. Because like I, it's like five bucks plus shipping. With shipping, it's normally like ten bucks is a lot of tea, but it's not too bad. Not too bad. I just said, if you guys don't make trouble, uh, again, you can go to eat nice. You better stay good. You better stay on your teacher's good side so you guys get to go get some delicious food. Mm. Did you say where you're going to go eat, though? What sort of, Do you know what sort of food you're going to go get? The boys in my class uh, bought fake Doogie Cups. Wait, you for fake ones for 450 pounds? Or that'd be your, your 450 euros? They got, they got ripped off. If it's fake, it should be like three euros. <laughs> Another try sample out next. Yeah, definitely, definitely, definitely mad at her. Um, it, it's only really mostly for um, Americans for it because like the shipping doesn't make sense outside of it. For any, but any of my, um, yeah, and we're using a baby guy wand, a lot smaller guy wand today, so we can sample a bunch of different ones. I'll try using like three grams each one, but we'll see. Some of them, I, there's one of these is like a a tea ball, which I'm gonna be forced to use a whole tea ball. I don't know how how heavy it is, but whatever. We will cross that bridge when we get to it. How are you doing, Anna? Welcome to stream. Good morning. Actually, I feel like Anna, you woke up like six hours ago. Because like, half the time, when I'm up way too late, I'll see Anna a message and I'll like reply to it. I think she knows I haven't gone to bed when it's like 5 a.m. my time and she wakes up. <laughs> she has a healthy sleep cycle. I don't. I don't. For the new boy, you have 60 fake Gooey Cups? What the heck? Why would you need that? Okay, why would you need 60 cups? I don't care if it's fake or real. Why, who needs 60 cups? 4.30 a.m. That's too early. Uh, Ar Armadillo? Armadillo. Why, why is the first thing that comes to the mind? Okay, two things come to mind was how I mentioned Armadillo. One, like, you know, in my head, seeing one roll around. Two, for some reason, I always think about, I think people eat those, right? People, I think people eat armadillos. It's very strange to me, but hey, I, I people do what they want as long as the animals are endangered. So I, I won't be eating it. It's, I'll say it won't be my cup of tea, but ugh, I mean, maybe it tastes okay. Uh, pangolin, is that, is, that, is that what they're called? Is that the species pang, pangolin? Is that the species that armadillos are from? Dude's that like justice for armadillos! Yeah, they're too cute. Like they're they're in that weird category where they're like they're like ugly but cute sort of animal. Bro, they, they want to flex, so they get girlfriends. You know. You know what the fun thing though is Josh Neck. In my experience, the type of person who is like what you're describing, they're going to get to university. Or if they're still like that in university, when they get to their real world. They're going to be a nobody like everyone gets tired of fake people like that. Once you get over to the real world, <laughs> it's like, oh, you have your fake gooey cups. No one cares. And how you doing hamster in? Welcome to stream. We're going to be in a moment switching over to the tea again. We did finally switch over to a new lighting setup. It's oh gosh, it's about three hours setup. I learned about my calendar. Uh, did you hear do a 24 hour stream? Um, I've done 40 hour streams. I can do long streams. I did not hear the power. I was doing a 24 hour stream, but I could do one. I've my long time viewers will know that I've done multiple 40 hour streams. Okay. I only accomplished finishing it a couple times, but 40 hour streams is no sleeping. 36 hours is pretty easy for me. I don't have any plans on doing it, but no, I, I used to be known as an endurance streamer, which is funny because like on YouTube, my streams are so short, but I just find, I find that uh, if I do super long streams, is this going to be boring? This going to be boring. I don't know. If, if I had something to do for like a 24 hour straight, sure, but maybe someday, maybe someday. They are fun. Uh, oh, so uh, let me switch over to full. Uh, do you, yeah, you can like my stream. I would love to. I love 
to see uh, if, uh to bring some of those tea guys over here. Oh my gosh, let me get my step stool, guys. I'm gonna let all, all, all get scared. One, two, three, jump! Ha! There we go. Yeah, definitely, definitely. I would. No, nothing helps the creator more than if you share them with your friends or otherwise. Especially since, like, a lot of times, you as a viewer are able to post where creators can't really self-promo without being awkward. <laughs> so definitely, 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 please do share my stream. It would definitely help me out. Hell yeah. And maybe they can see me drinking for all these teas. And for proof, this is our green screen. This is my, uh, the oh, but I, I, I've mentioned this before. So on my outfits, I cut the arms off of it and they're like multiple segments. But here is the arm band of the green screen. I'm wearing blue now. Ah, I'm a blue boy. But yes, we have, we have a lot of tea. There's, there's, there's a lot of tea here. Let me try to pick up all the tea. It's, t oh, 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 there's 10 of them. Let me, there's a lot, I, I, I don't have all the yet. They're almost, oh, it's falling. <laughs> Here is all of the tea, ah! <laughs> Hell yeah. I'll just pick up one at random. I guess we're gonna drink this one first. It is. Here it is. Bingwei Sheng Poor. It's a we got. We're gonna serve a Sheng. Looks like the funny thing about this is they definitely are used to the bag. Cause there's like a he must have had too much of these extra bags. He put a, he put a label over what it's not. Yeah, this is what we'll be drinking. Let's go measure out some luxury brands. Appeal to yeah. I, I'm not mm, the only luxury stuff I'm into is stuff that's like. Like, there's some luxury cooking stuff that I'm into, but like, I'm into luxury tools. Not so, like, luxury apparel so much. Ooh. Well, I will pull the pieces out and we're gonna try to measure around three grams. There we go. The rest of luxury luxury spoon. So this is if it'll focus. If it'll focus, you get a fly on it. Here's a big old chunk of that shing. Oh, oh, oh got it focused there a second. There we go. Here is the chunk of that shing, and we're gonna break off a chunk from there. Try to get around three grams worth. Because this guy one is pretty small. I normally do it on three grams. <laughs> This, I have a scale. Let me go and turn it on. It's on grams. Oop. I did not mean to switch units on there. I'm a Baca. Grams. Zero it out. All right. Now I'm going to try to get three grams. Currently, this chunk was eight. Oh, nine grams. So we need less than half. We need less than half of this. But this chunk was nine grams. We're going to break off a chunk. Uh, four grams, close enough, close enough. All right, close enough. You guys, these fresh, what, fresh, what, what are you talking about, dressing Nick? Schmoll. Looks like dead meat, oh no. Oh, so I should have these off to the side where it's clear I've had it already. All right. Here, here is our first tea. Again, it was one last time, this is a tea we're drinking first. All right. Let's go ahead and do the rinse. And we will first, well, I think I'm just gonna rotate between feeding bubbles and bobbles. So bubbles will get the first one. I'm just gonna quick rinse. There we go. Chicken, how you doing Commander Ravener? I see you found a new avatar. Here we go, Bubbles, have some tea! Actually, let me fix them please. Sing better. Have some tea, Bubbles. It's a little sippy sip. These samples are not gonna be huge sips, but there will be a lot of them. Okay, now we're gonna make our real infusion. This is gonna be the one we're gonna drink. 
and we'll have a couple cups. Like maybe like three. We're not gonna be able to deeply drink fruities. But it's okay. We're in a sampling. We're in sampling. Oh, that tea looks so much better. I think for, oh gosh, that looks so much better. Bubble did a bubble, hell yeah. How you doing? Um, how you say your name? Uh, Comey. Welcome to the stream. Today we're drinking some, no, today we're drinking 10 different um, teas. This is from the Licoporist Poor Tea Sampler Beginner Pack thingy. This is, this is our first tea here. Man, the blue screen does look a lot better. As much as I pain ass it is, I might just need to buy more lights because this looks a lot better. Like, I think I'm gonna have to spend like another freaking 60 bucks in lights. <laughs> but you guys can hit that super chat and membership button to help me with that. <laughs> mm. See that one weird? The first tea we're starting out with it is this tea, the Shing. So we're sampling this one first. Yeah. Let's take another sip. This is definitely Shang. So I have some experience with Shanks and Poor's. Still fairly new to them. Kind of like an earthy green tea. So this must be aged. So we don't have like a, yeah, I don't have a year on this Shang. It just says like, you know, it just, it doesn't say a year. So I don't know what year this is from. I want to say this is a tiny bit of an aged Shang. It has to be, this has to be like over three years old. It has to be. Let's finish the rest of this. I'm gonna I'm gonna do a few more cups of this before we move on to another tea. Because we have 10 teas, we can't like drink a whole liter of every tea. Bald! Oh, I'm talking that word. Uh, I think it's it's hair. Alana, Alana, it's it's exclamation point hair, not bald. Try exclamation point hair. And it should work. There we go. Hell yeah. I'm bald! <laughs> All right, let's let's take another cup of this. Oh, so Komi, are you from the the tea Discord, or are you just are you finding my stream some other way? I'm always curious. So I know that um, oh gosh, now I'm blanking your name. Freaking, I'm really bad. I know Bitsu said they were sharing it, but I don't I don't know if that's where you came from. Whoop. Or maybe you've been here for. I know I, I have a hard I have a hard time keep track of everyone. <laughs> From the DT Discord, hell yeah! That's what, <laughs> like I don't, I don't hundred. I think I think I seen their name before, but I think I, think I saw your name in stream. But he, here it is. All right, this looks so much better. That but I, I'm glad. So Bitsu kind of bull bullied me slightly to set my uh, blue screen up. You guys are finally getting the real colors on this crap. Hmm. I was just spent like a good three four hours optimizing the the camera settings, but. There's still more work I could do. Yeah, the best, I don't know how old this Shang is, but like it's a earthy green tea taste, which is what generally I get from, it's smooth, definitely. But I generally get that sort of flavor from aged Shangs. I do like Shangs. The pink dip is so, it is so much better. But it was like, it's not just the blue the blue screen. I could have gone to green screen better, but like uh, my lights are completely different setup. I completely changed how my lights are. I have I have how much? I think I have like three or four hundred dollars worth of lights, something like that. I I moved my lights around, and I I, I got better with using the ISO settings. I'm like I just. It's not just a blue screen. The blue, blue is blue is really hard to get right because you need a ton of light. So l blue blues don't don't reflect light as well. There's lots of reasons blue is really hard to blue screen. You need a crap ton of lights. You flying clean camera? No, I, I I'm using a different. Oh no, I'm using uh we're using a blue screen now. See, you can see the green. This is this is the arm off of my green screen suits. So I'm wearing like a full body little suit there, but let's let's just take another little sip. I've had I've had okay. So the best way to describe this actually is 
I know it's a shang, but I've had shoes. Uh, some of the better shoes I've had, it sort of tastes like this. It's like in the middle ground. Because if you ever had like a shoe that's like not overly gross, they sort of taste very slightly earthy, but like it's definitely just like green tea still. Uh, so, so many. Oh, camera's a ton of. Yeah, tam camera's a ton of work. Like, most VTubers have a far less technical setup than mine. Like, the, the, the setup I stream with is stupidly technical. I, I, I do have a technical background, so it helps, but <laughs> it's not easy. <laughs> There's a reason why I, sh I do shorter streams. I'm spending so much time on that crap these days. I swear. Oh. Fine. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and move to the second tea, but let me go and show you what that tea looked like after we did like three or four infusions. We're gonna we're just gonna deposit it. Actually, should I put it on a plate? Guys, should I put this on no I, I don't have room. I'm gonna have to put this on the plate. Let me Did I put it? Did I have a plate in, no I have to grab it. I'm gonna grab a small little plate to put all these teas on, so let me grab that. I, I don't have room in my tea tray. There's just not enough room for 10 teas. Uh, so. I got my smallest plates. Here it is. We gotta, I know my white balance is still kind of messed up, but whatever. Yeah, so one thing I still want to work on is not being oversaturated in my white balance, but here is the first tea. We'll just kind of grab another tea out of here. Ooh, this one. Okay, this one's kind of interesting. This is another, I believe this is another Shang. Yeah, raw pour. This is another Shang. This, this is part of a 3,000 gram raw pour cake that uh, liquid pours broke up. And we're gonna, we could all try out a little bit. Yeah, raws don't change much as they're older, is what everyone says. One dude on the tea door says 10 years minimum. Oh yeah, I've, I've had um, Shangs from like the 90s before, and you can tell, they were like way different. Uh, now, way different in like, but here's the thing, he's wrong in the fact they do change. They do change. I think you need a minimum of like two or three years for Shangs to taste like anything that's not green tea. But then I bet it doesn't, I, I'll believe him that he doesn't change after like two or three years, it probably doesn't change until 10 years. <laughs> Like, a fresh shank, it's just green tea. And like two or three years, it starts to taste more like, like poor, not poor, not poor like a, something else. And damn, um, welcome to stream. Let's sleep for a little bit. Gotta sleep soon. Have a good sleep when you get some sleep. And the, um, F, uh, F Mao, um, off no, off Mao, you got set over to, uh, heaven. Who did? Humboost? You talking about the tea? I'm confused. I missed something, but let's go ahead and open up this 3,000 gram one. Doo -doo -doo. Let's go tear it open. I will eventually get scissors if I need it, but it's fine. Luckily, I could know if I've opened something and we've gone through it by the fact it's open or not. Okay, let me dry my fingers off. And I'm gonna grab, I'm gonna, probably immediately break this up, but here is, here it is. We got a big old chunk. There's more of it, but this is the shake we're going to be tasting. I don't know what year it is. Once again, this one does not have a year, which kind of annoys me, but whatever. Uh, everyone going to cry. I don't want to cry. <laughs> oh, jeez. We're gonna turn on. I'm just gonna weigh this directly on the scale because I don't want it to get wet. I'm just gonna let's see, like actually see how heavy it is right now. For reference, this here apparently is 11 grams, so we're gonna break that in half and it shouldn't have a smaller one. Uh, five grams. I'll break a little bit off of that. I don't want five grams. Uh, three again. Perfect. Okay. This here is three grams, which is what my goal weight is on these. Can, can you please? My goal weight on these is three grams. It's because my guy one is so small. <laughs> Free sampling. 
Oh, jeez. Let's go. Go taste this one as well. And we're going to give this, this rinse over to Bobbles. Our turtle. Whoop. I mean, there's a reason that um, Onigiri, who has the same setup as I do, uses a blue screen. It's better. It's just... It has such a high light requirement. Here are you... Oh. oh, this has a... I think this is literally fresh. I think this shang is like... I'm, sn I'm sniffing it. I think this shang is just green tea. I doubt it's much more than a year old. This smells super new. Like, it just smells like green tea. But we'll see in a second. Three grams, hard enough for 99 gram tea. I, I don't have a big enough guy one for that. <laughs> oh, jeez. Here we go. I'm mostly using a slightly different camera angle, but let's go in four. I do like this baby guy one. Hi, Nikamasa Moon, and welcome to stream. We're currently on our second tea out of 10. And I can show you Let me try. Help me out the rest of that. Boop. I want to show you what this tea looks like after the two little infusions. It's, it's, if I can get the light to hit it right. I need more lights in here. Here we go. This is just two infusions, so it's gone. It's gone a little bit. It's still, it's still brick form. Has not fallen apart yet. And here's our tea. Oh my god, that that. The blue screen's actually keeping its color. I like that. I like that. Hmm. I think I'm gonna. It's not gonna start gonna be useful for a lot of the tea heads here. You want to stretch it? Stretch it. You know what? This might be older than I thought it was. It smelled like new tea. There's not a strong flavor for this at all. It just tastes really smooth. Man, I would love to wake up to, uh, this is tea we're drinking right now, this some red of 300, 3,000 gram, it doesn't even say what it is, other it's a raw shang, whatever. But, this would be really nice to wake up to. There's not like a strong, overwhelming flavor. Mm. It's really smooth. I think when it ages more, it would get an actual flavor. I really don't have a nose. <laughs> it's Voldemort. Oh no! Oh, so I'm gonna take my hair back if no one else is going. Let me take my hair back. My head was getting cold. <laughs> I'll put my googly eyes on. Let me put my googly eyes on. Eh, there we go. <laughs> Again, we'll do like probably like three infusions of this to get a proper tasting of it before we move on to the next tea. Unbowed cat. Oh no, I'm a cat. Oh, I'm a little. I should probably move, let me move the model. I just realized I need to move my model a little bit so you guys can see it a little better. Hi, my mouse here. One moment. I need to move it. Like that, I think. Oh, no, it's too low. Oh, I think we can make himself smaller. I'm bowed. Okay, you can keep the ball. You, you redeemed it. A little bigger. It's really hard to do this. I'm doing it from like really far away. I think this is. Go back to my OBS. There, that's better. That's better. Ah, now you can see my head properly. My mom asked um, for help with the computer. She blue screened? She blue screened her computer? She blew it! Well, did you fix the problem, Rexy? Uh, was she, wait, did she punch the screen? Do I have skull now, maybe? Oh, you're asking for a big Well, Welcome back, Rexy. Did you fix the screen game? Some duct tape will fix it up, huh? There's a little bit of duct tape. Anyways, here, let's check some more of that. A tail wag, yes. Is, is a tail wag even visible on this? I think a tail isn't really visible, unfortunately, right now, but... 
She dropped the computer. Wait, is it, is it a laptop? It must be a laptop then, because you don't just drop a... I'm thinking of like a normal monitor. Hmm. Yeah, it's... it's just, yeah, this is just really smooth. It's not like there's no particular flavor to it. Other than like... It tastes like a really smooth green tea. I can't imagine this is more than like a year old. Like, they probably just pressed it. <laughs> <laughs> Think she moves a lot of around, son? Well, have fun fixing the display. You grab your iFixit toolkit. No, <laughs> I would be too scared to like any like hard repairs like that on tech. I'm always, I always break something else when I'm trying to fix it. So I just don't. Now you want tea? You should get yourself some tea. Tea's pretty like. He's pretty cheap. You can get yourself some. Rexy put duct tape over it. He's, you just buy new Anna. Yeah, at some point you just like, I can't fix this. I'm gonna, well, you can go to a repair shop. But hopefully it's at least like two or three years old so you can rationalize just buying a new one. So why am I smaller? No, I'm just gonna go to the, the size I had earlier. There we go. I'm the size earlier, but I'm gonna move myself to the center. There we go. That, that's that's better. <laughs> that's better. I, I, I had to fiddle with that some, but it's okay. Mm. You know what, tea? Well, you can, you can buy some online. Oh, we're gonna do, I'll do one more, cause I really like this tea. We're gonna do one more cup of this. We're gonna, I think I'm gonna end up drinking like four liters of tea. Just FYI, guys. I foresee myself drinking like four liters. Cause we've already, we've already made a dent in this tea. But it's okay. My hair's back, hell yeah. Okay, we're gonna show you guys. This is, oops, let me get up. Can the light focus on it? I need to go. Oh, here, because I was blocking the light. There we go. So this is, this is a tea after about, what, three or four infusions plus the rinse. Let me go ahead, put it onto the tray. I will not be doing the curse thing I did the other time where I mix them together. I'm not doing that today. If you guys look at my tea videos, there's a very cursed video I did where I mix all the teas together in a big teapot. I'm not gonna do that today. I am forever bald. Mm. But let's go and grab our next tea. Can I get a, no, I, I know, let me get it. Let me get something that's not, not a shang. Why, hold on, I need something that's not a shang. Why is all shang? Let me get up, let me get, wh where's my, where's my thing that's not, where's my shoes? I mean, this could be a shoe. I don't know it by a name. Well, let's drink this. I don't entirely know if this is a shing or a shoe, but this is a 2015. Someone in chat can say, but 2015 Lacan. Lacan. That's what we're gonna drink next. Boop. Ingredient. Uh, do I need to get scissors? I need to get scissors from this. One second. Yeah, yeah, feel free. Feel free to post in the uh, look of porous. 2015 well. Lee Chong. Oh, hello, Tori. Hello, Tori Raiders. I am Daishima Magical Boy. Today we are drinking 10 different teas. We just, we're just about to go into our next, I don't know if it's a shing or shoe, but how is the cooking today, Tori? I believe you're making some chicken wings. Now I did suggest you add Red Bull to give double wing power, but Tori didn't listen. But welcome to stream, Tori, Delta, Tori Tiger. and all the other, all the other Tori, uh, <laughs> Tori Raiders. For anyone who doesn't know, um, <laughs> would know Tori is another uh, cooking VTuber. She does a lot of hand cam stuff like this, cooking streams. They're always good to watch. Welcome to stream as well, FD. Uh, we got Estella. Hello, hello, hello. She been drinking some old tea. Yes, I am. I have. I don't have the, oh, here's some old, we could, we could, no, I wasn't doing different, no, well, we're gonna do the one I was playing to, but I do have old tea here. We have a 2006 tea here we'll, we'll drink eventually. 
There's a 2012 a tea from the end of the world. No, it's not. Please focus your camera. There, a 2012 one. But we're going to be drinking this 2015 one now. I need to get scissors. One second. You gotta go, Commander Raven. No problem. Have a great rest of the day. Yes, uh, if, if anyone would like to, I, I've had a couple people ask if they could share my stream in a couple discords. If, if you know some people who would like this sort of content like tea, feel free to share with your friends. Any content creator would love that. Hell yeah. But let me let me grab the scissors. One second. I need to be able to cut that. It doesn't have a tear label. It does not have a tear bag like the other ones. Okay, I have... Oh, are these, are these invisible? <gasps> They're invisible scissors! <laughs> I have got my magic eyes of blades! I'm floating blades! Because <laughs> I moved to a blue screen <laughs> under this. <laughs> my scissors are blue. <laughs> oh my goodness gracious. They're like school scissors. You know, you know the type, right? They, they do the job. Let me just cut this. Hopefully that was enough to open it up. Okay, come up, please. Or do I have to cut more? No, I think that's enough, I think that's enough. Hell yeah. If anyone hasn't already smashed that like button, please do so, it's always appreciated. Jalen, you're eating some food? What, what are you eating? What are you eating? Corporal swords, <laughs> exactly. Oh gosh, I'm... Why am I blanking on the name of the anime though? But like, it's so good. It's finally a VRMO anime, it's like not trash. Which is funny because the anime is about a character who's a trash gamer. Okay, we're gonna put that there. Okay, so this here is eight, this here right now is eight grams. It is, let me put this on the screen. We have, please focus. Thank you, we have eight grams of that. We're gonna go ahead and break that in half. We want about three or four grams. Okay, we have, uh, let me break off a little extra chunk. That should be about, that should be right there, should be about three grams. There we go. We'll have about four grams for another day. Let's seal back up. Okay, let's go ahead and do our rinse. Whoop. And yeah, if anyone ever has any questions about tea, oh, I should explain for anyone who's new here, uh, we're, what we're doing is a, it's called the Gung Fu Tea Ceremony. Essentially, all it is is we do a bunch of really tiny baby um, infusions of tea, approximately 10 seconds each. And then you reinfuse the tea over and over and over. Now we're trying 10 of our teas now, so we're not fully infusing, getting all the, tea, the flavor out of these teas. We're doing like three or four infusions and moving on to the next one. But for this one, let me take a sniff of it. I think it's the Shang. I've had three Shangs in a row, which is not a problem, but I think it's another Shang, a really young sh uh, shoe. I'll, I'll know when I taste it though. But there you go, Bubbles. Delicious. And again, if you guys are also not if you're also liking what you see here and you're not subscribed, smash that sub button and you know all that stuff. All that YouTuber stuff I have to say. But let's continue with the tea and taste what this is like. Let's see what this tastes like. Oh, and for anyone who's trying to get a view on what I'm doing, basically what we do is you put, if you ever drain pasta, that's kind of like what a guy, a guy one works. You push the lid down and you strain it with the lid. Like you're draining the pasta with a, with just a pot. That's how I always drain pasta, at least. Boop. All right, yes, we got it. The three finger method. Yes, um. I think I use more than three fingers when I use a normal size guy one, but this guy one is, this is the guy one I use for sampling because it's really small. You do want to want a big guy one for sampling. Was a raid, uh, Tori came over with her community and then redirected after stream to my community. It's kind of like Twitch's raids, very similar. But yeah, small baby guy won. But here is the colors on it. Very nice. Oh, 
Um. Yeah, I think this. No, there's, this can't be a shoe. They all, like, unless someone else here knows, I don't think this is a shoe. <laughs> I think this is another shank. But it's older. It ha it's starting to get much more of a flavor. What's what it tastes like? Because it's 2015, which is. It's getting up there in age. Not quite a decade old, but. It's starting to get other flavors in there. Hard to describe, but like, it doesn't taste like green tea at all anymore. Because the, the younger, yeah, it's so much of saying it's well cool. Yeah, because I, my thing with what the tea, with tea though is, I don't know what most of these like names mean half the time. All I know is they taste good. Like, I'm assuming that's like the origin of the tea or something. But like, a lot of the names that go with teas, I often don't know what they mean. I'm like, mmm, tea tastes good. <laughs> It's like the variety of other or otherwise, I'm assuming, but they they describe the flavor in a way that I have a hard time remembering. But it, it, it's it's a shame. It's all that matters, yeah. Like the cool thing about I guess I that's how I, I I'm good with I fit in with the tea community is like tea tastes good. <laughs> like I, I do I do drink cut the higher end teas as you can see here, but like. I'm not, probably not the best, even though I, I guess I'm kind of the bridge between the high grand tea community and people who haven't gone into tea, as that's what my community is kind of about. I'm not probably the best teacher for like some stuff, but maybe, maybe that's good. Oh, hi, you got me. Welcome to the stream. Uh, we're doing great. We're doing great. We're on our third tea. We've had three shakes in a row. <laughs> uh, we're, oh, so we're on a new blue screen. Hopefully, oh, besides the fact that my glove's a little transparent there. Ah! But, um, we're we having a good day. <laughs> I'm a tea man, yeah. Like, I know enough about tea to help people know that tea's not that hard. And I've, I've got, I think I've gotten a decent amount of people into it. It's a city in China. Ah, oh, okay, so that's just saying the city, yeah. Like, you should, here's the thing though, those names are not always locations. Sometimes they're like, oh, the, uh, let me see if I find one, I know it's on location. Man, some of these are just like... Like here, I'm sure Peacock is not not a location. This is one we'll have later, once it freaking... Can you please? Like, I'm sure Peacock is not a location. Maybe it is! <laughs> you get one of those taste kits that teach you different flavors? Yeah, maybe, maybe, maybe. That'll be fun. But too, if you guys... Or if someone like on a t one of T Discord's 2006 watch Peacock Sheng Puer. Puyoya. Yeah. Yes. A lot. Yeah, like I don't know half half those. Like I I kind of vaguely have understanding, but have you ever been into like a hobby where you can vaguely understand something, but you can't explain it to other people? I think that's where I'm at with tea. Like I can't put it I cannot put it in words. But, like, I like I understand, like, I can tie together the flavors to the names, but I can't really explain what they are. <laughs> Outside of, like, the, the broader ones, like oolong, you know, black tea, white tea, those are really broad. But, ooh. those are broad ones, and those are easy. Many words will succeed. Yeah, like, but that's what I like about tea. Like, I want to actually, one of my favorite parts about, like, the higher end tea community is like you can start to taste the land itself which is a really I, like that's why i like to explain to people like if you're really getting good tea the, you're literally tasting Attempting the land which is crazy chinese names chi chi ching q yeah. zhang li catching hey, hey the the tts bot can actually do a half decent job of that <laughs> oh okay let's have one last little cup here for this this tea before we move on to the next one. You're at the sea level of the iceberg as tea. Maybe a little blow. Yeah, I'm pro Bitsu, I probably have low to surface a little bit. But I'm probably also in, in one of the better places to bring new people into the tea community. Because, like, people that are, like, way too into it might be too intimidating. 
Like, I would love to have really in-depth videos, but this is not where I'm at. I, I do want to do a video on really basic stuff. Like, I want to do a video for how to cold brew, because a lot... Do you, I know it's really common for the, the tea community, like, uh, the higher tea community. We, like, we all know you can cold brew, but a, lo a lot of normal people don't know that you can cold brew, and I think cold brew tea or would be just hot brew tea just iced, which is not the same thing. Hey, and there's no experts in tea. There's people who are, have a lot of experience in different sections of tea, but the tea world's too big to really know everything about. That's just cool. There, there's a lot of talking in it. You can have one last cup of this tea. Hmm. And I'll move on to the next one. Too many tea boos in the community. It sounds mm -hmm. like lol. Maybe. Let me just shake that out. I don't know why I did that order, but whatever. We're gonna go ahead and put this onto our little plate here. So. And I'm gonna rinse this off because there's extra little chunks. Okay. We have a nice fresh guy one. I try to rinse off the lid too. Hold on a second. Chunks of tea on the lid. Okay. Like, people get really crazy into tea, but there's nothing wrong with that. Uh, I want to grab... Can I grab something that's actually a shoe? I saw one earlier. What? How? Are, I think almost all these are shoes. I'm not, I think almost all these are shangs. Unless, like, split in half. No, I think, like, almost all these are shangs, which is really funny. Was that on purpose? Oh, there, there's an annoying le least, but like, wait, this is raw too. Where? <laughs> this is raw. Wait, is there is there no shoes? There are shoes last year. This one could be. Uh, that's not a shit. I don't think there's any shoes. <laughs> I I think these are all, every single one of these. I think there are shings. That's crazy. Was that on purpose? No way. Well, that's fine, I guess. We're gonna get really deep into exploring shings, I guess. <laughs> oh, that's fine. There we go, we got the... Uh, last year we got, uh, it was a lot of shoes. It might just be what supply they had. I don't, should I do, we're gonna do this ball. So, it just says raw two. You'll, you'll, your plot twist came true. <laughs> oh no, you've cursed me. So for this tea, it seems it says raw two. It's a purple package. It's not blue, it's purple, but skin color heat out anyways. There's just two little tea balls. So I'm gonna get one of the tea balls out and we're gonna brew it. Doo -doo -doo. Hopefully I, that cut was enough to open it up. Hopefully, it, come on. It's fine. I, I do want to explore more shoes as well, but that's not gonna be Tay, it looks like. We're gonna get this tea ball. I will, I'm gonna weigh the tea ball, but I'm assuming it's like five grams is pretty standard. Oh my goodness gracious, please open. Please open. I'm having a hard time here. I'm struggling. I don't know if you guys can see. Uh, you know, you can tell, you can see kind of what I'm doing. I'm trying to open this Ziploc kind of baggy. Open, please. Oh, 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 I think I almost got it. Okay, I got it. Oh, jeez. Oh, these are flat. Oh, that's weird. Or are these both flat? Yeah, they are. That's really weird. Huh. So these T-balls are not T-balls. They're like... Is it like one T-ball cut in half? Is that what this is? Are these not six grams then? Because normally T-balls are like the whole ball. Like the dragon, you know, the little dragon balls. Oh gosh, now how they get this wrapper that's on there really tight? I might use my scissors. <laughs> I might need to use my scissors. No, I'm using scissors. Wrapper is on there uber tight. Whoever packaged this. <laughs> oh, geez. Oh, it's not going to come off nicely, but I will get it off. 
There we go. And it's free! Okay. Let's try to show us you guys. This is, this is what I was talking about. It's a veil focus. It's like half a ball. Interesting. Chunkier ball, maybe. <laughs> Stomped on Dragon Ball. <laughs> the Super Round. I don't know. <laughs> it's just a hollow in the center. Let's see how heavy this is. Let's see how heavy this is. Boop, zero it out. It is three grams. Okay, so this, I think this might be, uh, let me measure it again, but I think this is half a Dragon Ball. Or whatever you call it. Four grams. I got four grams that time. It's like three or four grams. Interesting. Because this is normally be, um, hey, what when, when time? Your creebly, pacely, act, posley? Oh. Cerebral palsy, cerebral palsy. Gosh, why am I illiterate? Cerebral palsy acts up, uh, right? Is that, I'm, I'm pronouncing it right. Is that what we're talking about? Bulma be like, you did what <laughs> to the Dragon Balls? Quote. Okay, cool. What, I, why is it, I was like having a stroke while reading that, I swear. <laughs> but yes, I can't imagine that it's easy to deal with that. Is it, but is it, so it's worse in the winter, just kind of like how people's bones hurt during the winter? Is it related to that? But hopefully you have a space heater or something to keep yourself warm. Because it does not sound fun. Dragon Balls are full ones. So to, uh, Tocha are bowl shape. So many, I, I don't know if I've ever had one of those, Komi. I don't think I've ever had one of the half balls before. Well, that's good to know. The half balls are definitely better for sampling like I'm doing right now. They're not really quite big enough for a normal session, but whatever, it's fine. It makes your finger numb? That's no fun. Well, I, I'm sure you know how to best take care of yourself, so hopefully you take your measures that you need to take. Now let's go ahead and give Bubbles, I oh know I gave Bubbles tea last time. We'll go, get the, we'll go bobble some tea. Here you go, my turtle. Excellent. Level look of um, compression mostly. What's the difference between that and pearl? Oh yeah, yeah, pearls. Well, I mean, isn't it also because pearls are bigger too? <laughs> what is this? Uh, we are drinking some very a, a bunch of different Shang pours. I thought there might have been shoes as well, but is a little basically half uh, spear of tea. And which one? It was this, it was this. Is this some raw, raw is this, is this from this package? Boop. As we always do, we drink some teas on, teas on uh, Sundays, but today we're sampling a crap ton of different ones. And Kimberly Fox, you're back with a different name and profile. Uh, would you like to lighten class with, okay. Oh, you're, you're um, off now. <laughs> it's like, we like to tell class who you are, because <laughs> I could take a wild guess, but <laughs> welcome back to stream. <laughs> we are just enjoying our tea still. <laughs> oh, geez. Oh, okay, we're gonna go ahead and let's taste this one. Ooh, it looks a little thinner, interesting. There's not as much color for this one. Like the camera is getting rid of a little bit of color, but that's opus exact. There's a tiny bit of yellow in there. You can kind of see that. There's really not a ton of color in this. Hmm. I think this is a fresh, I think, well, was there not a year on this? Oops, oops. Yeah, there's no year on this. This one tastes, this one just tastes like green tea. This, this literally, this, this tastes like the freshest one I had so far. I could maybe not be, but it's still a little bitter, which I think bitter is goes along with it being like a new shang. I could be wrong. Somebody please correct me if I'm wrong, but I do believe bitter is with the newer shangs because it kind of tastes like green tea. <laughs> but there could be other factors for that as well. 
But just a tiny bit of bitterness, but not too much. Yes. Ah, yeah. I am getting better with my shangs. Oh, so this one looks very gross on how it's breaking apart. I do not like how it looks like little worms. <laughs> I am not a fan on what this one looks like. Here, I'll, I'll kind of show it to the camera. I'll, I'll try it to little bliss. A little bit. Like, it's just kind of falling apart in a really kind of gross way. But, here we go. Oh, gee. It looks worse than the water's on it, but whatever. That's what the lid's for, right? <laughs> oh, jeez. Mm. Rip tea, indeed. Rip tea. I mean, taste... I, of all the teas we've had so far today, this is my least favorite. But uh, again, if this is a very new Shang, you're probably not supposed to be drinking this yet. <laughs> like, you're supposed to let age a little bit. And this, the other ones, I think, are a little older. There was one that was like 2015. That was much better than this. Now, there's a lot more factors to tea than just age. Like, in a lot of ways, I expect that one of the least important parts where the tea could taste very different just by being grown near some like wild fruit plants and stuff. But when you have a specific tea, then that specific one, when you age, it'll change a lot. But like, you know, <laughs> I, I don't. Aging, you can get a lot of different flavors from other ways of, you know, harvesting. Well, other ways of harvesting. These are all shanks, but how to describe it? It's more like... It's a, I think the environment is probably where I notice the most differences, usually. Like, oh, this is this is grown in Yuan province or whatever. They're very distinct. You have your, like, Raku Longs, which... Do they ever harvest... Shangs in the same areas they harvest like the Raku lungs from? I'm not sure. I'm sure they do. I'm sure they do, but. Because, oh, one fun fact for any of the people who are not into too deep into tea that I like to bring up is if you might think that tea would be, you know, like a lot of other plants where you want to like treat it really well to get the best tea flavor. But that's couldn't be further from truth. The reality of it is basically the better you treat the tea, the more boring it's going to taste, essentially. You kind of just want to edge your tea and um, let it suffer. So you just be sadistic of your tea and then it'll have some interesting flavors. Oh, that was, oh, that was steep too long, I think. <laughs> I think I oversteeped that one. <laughs> oh gosh. It'd be cool if they put some descriptions. Yeah. I, I thought they were going to put descriptions like a QR code because I mentioned that before, but there's nothing on it. So it's kind of like a wild guess on what these are. <laughs> I love your staring to your souls. So I'll make it to you at the same time. Yeah. Yeah. I got my googly googly eyes, which they are toggle. I mean, we like to toggle off my googly eyes. x just went googly. We have a lot of toggles. We have the hair. We have cat, the, I think, is it Neko for the cat? YOLO. Yeah, I think this is over. I think this is definitely over infused, but I'll finish that. <laughs> I must have gone distracted when I was infusing that one. Let me do a, a short infusion here. That one was just like, oh. <laughs> I must have started talking, let's see if like 10 or 20 or 20 seconds ago. Like, My eyes are back. Here we go. Let's drink this one. This will be the last of this tea and we'll go to the next tea. I do need to get more more tea or more hot water soon, but I think we do one more tea. Probably. No, this tea is just getting a weird flavor. This tea is getting stronger as I'm infusing it more. I think because it broke apart, 
No, it, it's, it's not my fusion time. I think when I broke it apart, it got, it has a lot more surface area now. That's really weird. Okay, I'm gonna do one more fusion on this. I'm not gonna drink it. I am not drinking this, but I just wanna do this for, let's brew it for a little bit. There's no way I'm drinking this. But I think because it broke apart, it has a lot more surface area now, and it's just getting super, like, fusing super fast. It's, yeah, the tea's opening up. Um, usually it doesn't, I, this tea, the, the, the pieces on this tea are very small. Like, I can show you on the little strainer, or at least I'll try to. The pieces on this tea are really small. They're kind of like falling apart. So there's, there's a crap ton of surface area. And it's making it infuse really quick. We're gonna show you this this tea. I'm not drinking this infusion, but I just wanted to show the color on it. I'll feed I'll feed it to bubbles. There we go. Oop. So yeah, it's gone it's gone even like this is getting crazy dark. It, it looks very compressed. It takes um, more water to run through to fully open the leaves. Yeah. Getting darker and darker. Yeah, I'm not used to happen. I I guess it happens in some teas, but most teas I have, I just I don't drink super compressed tea. Which is kind of, I'm not used to that, but let's just give Bubbles his tea. There's probably further we can go with that, but I'm not liking that tea anymore anyways. <laughs> I will move on to the next one. You might like that. I'm like, uh, I should have put a, I think I need that in a bigger guy one with more water. Like, I think it would have been okay with like 50% more water. Or I just need to do really fast infusions. Like really, really fast infusions. Or do some more rinses or something. Bubbles getting free shower, yes. Okay, we're gonna go ahead and put this again on our little our little tea plate. And now I need to rinse off these. The guy one. Oh, that got all. Like that got everywhere. Whoops. Go in. First, the uh, long seat, then short, then short for next. Yeah, no, yes, that's how I, I usually get, do shorter as I go along. Or generally, vaguely, like 10 seconds. But like, I don't, I, I don't think I've had much experience with, with highly compressed teas. Let me rinse off the strainer. Like, I've, I, I've had like Dragon Ball, like the full like pearls, so they're like six grams each or what, six, eight grams each. And those are not as compressed as what I just had, which I think you mentioned that earlier. But let's have another. I'm gonna keep the first tea if it helps bring this heat properly. Yeah, I, I my rinses are normally pretty short. They're normally just to rinse it off and open up a little bit. But this next tea is going to be this 2018 uh, Drek Shorst Shang from an unknown area. So we know basically nothing about this other than 2018 Shang. Direct source means absolutely nothing if you don't have the... <laughs> Direct source doesn't mean anything. Why, why would they be on here? Like, it does normally mean something like you're buying from like a shop. But in this case, where we don't know where it's from... <clears throat> I don't... <laughs> whatever. <laughs> I wish there was better description on these. Or something. Okay, I think this is kind of falling apart. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to try to shake this onto the scale until we get to the desired weight. I know, I know, the, um, directly to our pesticides. <laughs> oh gosh. I can't remember who it was talking about, um, the pesticide, uh, taster kit. So you could know what the pesticide tastes like. <laughs> oh. But, um. There we go. This is, we got three grams here. Direct <laughs> source from my uncle's cousin Bob's backyard, near where his pigs ate a kid a couple years ago. 
Seems legit. <laughs> so I'm about to keep all the steps, uh, steps, uh, short your tea kind turns, um, into green tea-ish taste. You talking about how I brew? This turns into green tea. I mean, there's, that's just cool about tea though. Like you could brew it for these ceremonies. It's all about showing off your skill to the people you're with. And that's supposed to be, the other thing I'm surprised is not anyone else who's like really gone forward with doing the Gung Fu ceremonies for a stream. Because this is, I, I like to tell people, this is very similar to how you would do a real like Gung Fu tea ceremony. The only difference is, is you dear viewer would be sitting like here and I would be handing you the glass of tea directly. But it's just a virtual version of that. Like the Gung tea ceremonies are always really social. So it's pretty, it's, it's, it's kind of made for this. It's kind of made for this. Welcome back Judd. And we're going to, I should have sniffed the, the tea leaves there, but whatever. We're gonna go ahead and pour. Oh, one nice thing about these gloves though, is they give me some heat protection. So I'm able to play it fast and loose with like the guy wands getting hot. Not that it's a, a super big problem when I'm doing these baby smaller ones, but I've gotten the guy one pretty hot when I'd use my normal size one. And with the gloves, it's like not a big deal. <laughs> they look nice on camera too. But, you know. Was that the first effusion? Yes, it was. I'll still sniff this. It just kind of smells like shag. <laughs> here, 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 bubbles. Now let's do ours. Ho oh, ho. Oh. No, uh, Just Cup, uh. <laughs> no, sure, you're a bad host. Justice Cup? You mean a fairness cup? I've never heard it referred to as a justice cup. And I do have a fairness cup. It's this thing back here. I use, uh, this here is my fairness cup. Or is justice cup something else? I don't know. <laughs> what does justice cup refer to? Let's go ahead and drink this now. It, it's a sh as a shing, all right, guys. <laughs> Last week was the first time you think I want to keep up, and I was barely able to hold it. <laughs> yeah, you'll get it. it. A lot of it is, a lot of it is just sort of you get used to it. It's because of the heat. That's one thing, but like, basically, what you do is you you push down the lid. You you can use yeah. It's completely okay to use two hands to go like this. With the bait, with the small ones like I'm using right now, I would never use two hands. But if you're if you're new and using a normal size one, use two hands, push the lid down, and you no, know, kind of like go like that. That's fine. How is tea? Squirrel Man, the tea's been good. This new tea we're drinking right now, uh, it doesn't have a distinct flavor or anything. It's a 2018 Shang. All these are starting to taste same as she. Because they're all shakes. <laughs> like, they taste different, but like, not as different as if somebody's wore shoes. I'll tell you that much. Oh. I've had so much tea in me. It was mainly heat. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You'll get used to it. Uh, you can also get gloves or. It depends, also depends on your, the type of guy one you have. Some guy wants to get hotters and others. Oh, another thing is it depends on how you hold it. You also hold the saucer. Oh yeah, yes, you also can hold the soft saucer, which might be even easier for you. You can do it like that. So you can do it like, this might be even less hot. Like, like this. Which I, I would show you that properly with it's, it's hard to show off with the smaller guy one. <laughs> but, you know. It, it's fine. 
But a lot of it has to do with how you hold it. Because if you hold it, if you hold it properly, I like the edges, you're not making as much surface area, so it doesn't get as hot. But you'll get you'll get better at holding it. You get better. Because we are you might be what you might be doing is you might be gripping the the very bottom, like on the sides, very you might be gripping it like this. And that will get hotter because it's like the broad sides of it. If you grip on the like the actual rim of it, you'll it'll be less hot. In my experience. My, my, uh, you're saying your mom's saying, um, doing looks like the bad science project. Wait, what? <laughs> it looks like a science project. <laughs> uh, someone just described your step as gung fu done by the smile. <laughs> Oh, oh, cause yes, I'm Master Hand. Ah! <laughs> oh my gosh, that's that's really funny. I do like the setup though. It allows me to use my it's a it's basically alternate reality setup where it allows me to use my VTuber setup, and then I also get to use the camera. It, it's cool. Hmm. It's cool, it's cool. Now let's do another <laughs> Oh my goodness gracious. Yeah, oh, so if I was dialing in a single T, I'd probably just temperature. I've been doing these all like 95 Celsius, but if I was dialing in a single T, I probably could get better flavors out of individual ones. That's just why I'm kind of sitting out. Welcome to stream, is that cool? Ooga booga. We are enjoying some delicious tea. Again, we, we do this every Sunday. We just do different stuff. Oh, and uh, next week, I'm pretty sure I know what next week I'm going to be doing. It's going to be a tea review of tea that was sent me from the company. I did a review. If you guys saw the review, I did the cold brew review. I kind of shit on the company some because that tea wasn't the best quality. But I will be reviewing there. <laughs> Oolongs on stream. Let me just sum up, because they did not pay me. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to spit facts here. I'm going to spit facts here. The, the, the IT world that sent their tea to me, it's basically the same quality as like Adagio, which is not bad. But they, they sent that tea to me doing the I drink tea like this. I'm like, bro, no, that tea's not that good. Like, it's not the worst thing ever. The problem is, the problem is, they're charging the same amount for their tea as, like, Y2T charges, or maybe a little less than Y2T. It's like, no, you can have cheap tea, charge a cheap price. <laughs> um, what, what's that? What's it called, the furry? I mean, I have the cat ears on. I'm turning the cat ears off. Now I'm not a furry. No. <laughs> You're gonna go to sleep, ham hamster. Have a great sleep, and I'll see you whenever next time is. Mm. Get some more of this tea. Mm. Yeah, this is like. Yeah, my, that's my sister's words on mine. Fair enough. I, I just think it's it's just funny uh, that like I think it's really funny that a uh, tea company that. The, basically sells the same quality tea you get from the cheaper online shops would go up to me and it's not a spot it wasn't a sponsorship they were just sending me tea to review so i'm like i i was fair uh do you want to see an impression of your dad how would i see that i would see that but <laughs> oh no Oh, what I would really love to do is I would love to have like a sponsor slash. Ow, oh, hot, hot! I'm right up my arm there. <laughs> um, moving on. That was my kettle. <laughs> um, I would like to do a sponsor, uh, like collab with probably like something like I think Y2T would probably be the easiest to do it with, but I don't feel like I'm big enough to do it yet. The truth of it is like. 
I'm probably not big enough for them to want to spend money on um, me selling their stuff. <laughs> uh, Mills. Arnica. What? What's the Arnica? What's the Arnica? <laughs> Whatever. But yeah. Be careful about the cat. I know, right? Because I was gonna rest. Because okay, the reason what I was doing is sometimes I'm real, I'm weird. I put my arm and rest on. You see this little circular part on top? This part does not get hot. And I rested my arm in there, but it, t it touched like the edge, which was hot. <laughs> I'm fine. Comedy gold, yes. It's going great, Davis. Where is the joy ourselves? These are. I think every single one of these are shangs. I thought there was going to be some shoes in here, but no, it's all shanks. I am enjoying myself. I'm also enjoying uh, with this new... I'm using my blue screen setup, so now we you, I can see we're on a blue screen. It does definitely look sharper as well. It, I spent like three-ish hours last night switching over to a blue screen. And I think it was worth it. It was worth the sleep I lost. <laughs> oh, jeez. Giant hand uh, versus Smash Bros. addiction. Who will win? Do you like your your profile picture, Zach? Honestly, Zach, I can barely tell what you're... Oh, 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 thanks so much to hydrate. I got the water. Hmm. Oh, and I guess that was a boba that goes on my mouth when I would hydrate. But, um... You, Zach, you're, I can't even tell what your profile picture is. All it looks like is a circle of some red and blue. I can't tell what it is because it's, uh, it's really far from me. <laughs> it's a circle of red and blue. I can't really speak on if I like it or not. It doesn't really look like much to me, but that's because I'm really far away from it. Maybe it's good. But Warrior Cats, is it? I can't, I honestly can't tell. It's hair, uh, Davis, it's hair not bald. Hair not bald. Exclamation point hair. Is it? I, I really can't tell. It, the circle on my sub is really small for the avatars. Here, have a sippy sippy. Mm. Hot. I, I do have to, I bet, like I could almost guarantee once I, once I like feel like I'm like fully established, let's say I had like, I don't know, a couple hundred average viewers. I guarantee we'll start to see other content creators start to do more tea content. Maybe born for me, but like, I, I legitimately think I might have a, a, a impact on, I'm a hair! Um, I think I might have an actual impact on a tea industry, which would be cool. Which would be cool because what, what sets me apart different from a lot of the other tea creators you see is majority of my, audi majority of my audience is people I introduced to tea. Because those are all new eyeballs coming into the tea community with Buddy, maybe for to buy, shop at some tea shop. <laughs> That's kind of a big deal for the tea industry. <laughs> I'm not big enough to really make an impact yet, but like, if I, if I was... Like at like a couple hundred average viewers, I probably would even at that point make a noticeable impact. I guarantee it. Die, die, uh, what? Die's cool. I'm cool. Thank you so much. Oh, so I need to refill my kettle because the kettle is empty. Oh, oh, don't worry about that. Um, <clears throat> I, I poured some on the counter, but um, I, I'm gonna go ahead and. Uh, <laughs> I didn't realize there any is left in there. I'm gonna go ahead and refill this. Give me like two seconds. The fridge is right behind me. I'm gonna go fill it with some filtered water. I always use filtered water for my kettle. Uh, some people have good enough tap water. I don't trust the tap water enough. I always use filtered tap water for my tea. It, it's good. Don Borch thing is cold right now, so it tastes like another, it tastes like another mint to heat up, but like whatever. It's nice and delicious. Ice cold water. Set. Coming on back. <laughs> oh my goodness gracious. Alright. Here it is. Turn the kettle back on. Bowed. It's hair not bald. The command is hair not bald. 
And hydrate. I think that was my big cool. I'll, I'll hydrate. I'll hydrate again. Mm. Encounter was thirsty. It was indeed Anna. Okay, let's let's find what our next. Well, first, first, let's go ahead. While this heats up, we're gonna go and I'm gonna go sort these teas to be a little closer together. Boop. There we go. And look at. There we go. Got we got five on there now. We are we are ha we've we've had half of the teas. We've had five out of ten of the teas. <laughs> Hell yeah. I mean if you sell five to go. Let's go rinse out my, my stuff. Got to rinse that off. Got to rinse the lid. I'm gonna rinse the little strainer. Get the other keys off. There we go. Use me. And our next tea. Our next tea. How about how about this one? We got Hong Pu Cheesy Shank Core. It's 2006. This one's I think it might be the oldest one. It's 2006. Uh, Hung Poo Cheesy? Did I fix that? I don't know. You can see on screen. Oop. Mission, get Dai's hair back. Actually, I just want hair. Does give my hair back. And it toggles, it toggles it. I don't need scissors for this, I think it's tear. Let me actually dry it off first. Dry it off. That's good enough. Yep. Tear. Off. Oh, and for anyone who is who would say like, "Oh, die!" Did you make sure you rest your tea for long enough? Yeah, the tea was sitting and resting for over a week. Now it was sealed in the bag, but from what I understand, that's fine. I think. I believe when you're resting your tea, you don't have to actually open up every single bag. You can just let sit for like a week on the counter and fine, or whatever. That is my understanding, at least. But. Uh, let's just. Hmm. Let's, let's. Actually, I'm going to measure this separately. I think this is. Oh boy. Got, it got the thing wet. At seven grams. Okay. I'm going to break this in half. I'm trying to get three grams out of this. Oh, three grams. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Okay. Again, we're going to be drinking this tea. And let me go show you the three gram chunk we got. Here it is. Well, let's see how the kettle is doing. We're up to 75 Celsius. So it'll be up to temperature very shortly. Very, very shortly. And once up the temperature, it keeps on temperature. It has a temperature hold thing. Try nine, uh, how, how many, how many columns would that be? But yeah, I think it's 9,999,000. Do you know uh, about the ability to make viewers um, an avatar? Oh, you're talking about stream avatars, Zach? Yeah, I know how to use stream avatars. I know Power Guy used it. It doesn't really make sense for me. And there's issues with stream avatars using all of your API requests. But yeah, I, I know I know about stream avatars. I believe I told if you saw if you learned it about it from Power Guy, I believe I told Power Guy that it works on YouTube. <laughs> uh, but yeah, yeah, I do know of it. I own it. I've used it in the past. I don't think I'll use it myself, because it doesn't really make sense for my setup. But, I don't know. That works, it makes more sense for like, a, if you have an overlay or something, which I don't use an overlay anymore. Yeah, the Pokemon avatars, I don't know how copyright is on those, but like, I think there might be copyright issues if you like, Nintendo realizes you use them, I don't know. Like on Twitch, it doesn't matter because copyright doesn't exist on Twitch. Oh, this is almost up to temperature, guys, almost up to temperature. We're at like 90, 
four. There we go. Okay, let's go ahead and do our rinse. There we go. Put the lid on. Again, this is T number six. And I'll put the name up there again in a second. Uh, it's T number six is from 2006. What do you know? But eh, shake, shake. Oh, there's still some more in here. There we go. I, I didn't open up the lid enough. <laughs> there we go. So this is the 2006. You see on screen. I don't feel like saying it again. <laughs> Let's go ahead. I'm gonna go ahead and give this to Bobbles, our turtle. Stay well fed. Boop. But the Pokemon after is this is like a, I think it's copper issues. Could be wrong. Boop. Really want to work the tea pets today. Yeah, the tea pets are being well hydrated today. It's it's like a party for even the tea pets. Although each one of these uh, little cups I'm feeding them is smaller, but overall they're probably drinking way more than they usually do, but that's fine. That's fine. Whoop. We got a sample through them. This is trippy. Oh, welcome to stream, Run Rev Collins. We're sampling 10 different, sh I, I, I thought they were just shoe well, but these are 10 different Shangam Portis. This one drink right now, but how are you doing on this fine day? This is the this is what this one looks like right now. It's a nice golden color. And I'll take my first taste this one. It's gonna taste like a shang. Although this is 2006. This is 2006. I bet it has a bit of a different flavor. Let's see. Oh yeah, this one definitely. Like I I think I yeah, because it's it's old enough where it definitely has it tastes like old shit. I don't know. <laughs> it's almost it's almost decade old. It's 2006, which you know, we're not on a decade yet, but uh, we're getting there, right? It's pretty old. Talking about, uh, Pokemon after have something that uh, about them that just I don't know. You you don't you like them or you don't like them? I don't know. <laughs> Let's pour ourselves another cup, though. And I'll show you what the tea looks like. And our little guy won his wheel. Oop. Let's go here. Great tea, Shesh. I'll thank you so much. Um, Run Rev, are you from the Tea Discord? Or... I I'm assuming you might be from there. I otherwise, I would love to know how you found me, because I believe you are new to here, and I hope you're enjoying your time. I do these tea streams every Sunday. I used to do cooking streams of a very similar setup. Actually, basically the same setup. The camera's a little more zoomed out for the cooking one. But a look of porous Discord? Oh, hell yeah! Yeah, I, I have my Discord... Oh, no, I have my Discord. I have my VTuber model here, and I have, like, a... I'm using a blue screen. I just actually switched to blue screen. I used to use green screen. It's a very nice setup. It allows VTubers to do a very fancy mixture between, like, what you would consider normally only for, like, a... a normal... Streamer. I replaced myself with my model. <laughs> By the way, um, the live stream. Oh, huh? By the time live stream, uh, it's, going, it's going to blow up the notifications of what? I'm confused. I don't know what you're talking about, Kimberly, but okay. <laughs> oh my goodness gracious. Let's take another sippy sip. By the way, Run um, Run Rev, did you uh, have you did you pick up the Liquid Porous um, beginner pack? Because I think last year, which my first, I was much newer in tea or poor tea last year. I'm still fairly new to it, which I picked up again. But last year, there's a lot of there was a lot of shoe. This year, there's absolutely none in my pack. Uh, you have some. You have storms, Zach. Storms of. Yeah. Wait. Wait, 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 wait. No, 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 it's 17 years. No, 2006 was 10 years ago. No, it's not, not that old. No, no, 2006 is not that old. 17 years ago, no. <laughs> you just may feel old. I thought 
six was sixteen. I'm old. <laughs> oh no. That's why it's one taste like super aged. It's. <laughs> I was thinking sixteen, not six. <laughs> oh man, Bitsu. Now I'm old. <laughs> You hate what, Gum Zack? <laughs> I don't want to, uh, I, I didn't, as I went tat, I ordered the last two years. Sitting on 7.5k, um, like, dollars of tea, yeah. I've, okay, I've been pretty good about not overspending on tea. What I do right now is I, I'm subscribed to, um, All The Ways Teas, Tea Club, which comes every two months, and I'm also subscribed to White to Tea Tea Club, which is every month, and that's the majority of my tea. It's just because as a creator, I want to show, oh, oh, kilo or oh, of weight. Okay, okay, weight not well. That's probably more than you, you probably spent less than a dollar a gram. That's still a lot of tea. Seven point eight kilos of tea. That's still a lot of tea. Oh uh, yeah, I, I, I've been basically just surviving off of the tea clubs and those are just stuff for me like, oh, every every month I get to have something like this and I'm like, oh, let's sample a new tea club box stuff. Because as a creator, I want new teas all the time. If I was not like a content creator, I'd probably just buy a tea cake or two or something. Oh, Storms is messing up the Wi-Fi. Oh no, Zach! I'm sorry. <laughs> Hopefully he clears up. Oh, geez. That's a crap ton of tea. All, it kind of reminds me, uh, let me, um, actually, let me, uh, let me pour this over here. Hold on. I was going to, where is it? Ah, here it is. So one of the, one of the bags we got was, is part of a 3,000 gram piece. This is still less than what you got this year. The Ligoporus got a 3,000 gram or three kilos broken up to a bunch of people. That's a lot of tea and that's still less than what you got. <laughs> uh, you slowed down. Uh, so you're still on the um, EdSense of uh, Tea Club. Yeah, I like... I like Tea Club because it's new things. I think best case scenario for me is I want to get to the point where I don't have to spend money on tea anymore and I start to get like good tea sent to me for free. Or if I like start my own tea shop, or I, I I would be against having a small amount of tea I sell as merchish or some sort. Not 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 anytime in the near future, but like I think it'd be cool if I could essentially like white tea or something set me tea for free as like a sponsor kind of thing where I just be I don't know you know you know what I mean, and then I wouldn't send money on tea anymore. <laughs> oh. Kind of like how uh, the IT world, but with much better tea, yeah. Which, it's very feasible that I would have that happen. I, I would have to be a lot bigger than I am right now. But if I was a fairly big tea creator, it would make sense if I got, like, tea clubs sent to me from, like, the various proper shops. Or whatever. Ooh. Like, there's lots of ways it would make sense for that. A friend, a tea friend, he sent three small white tea tea cakes. Nice. There's white tea, tea is expensive, but like they're at least worth it. Like there's a lot of small tea shops that just charge a lot of money and they pretend their tea is good, and that that always bugs me. <laughs> like it's it's not any of the ones that anyone ever talks about. It's like the unknown brands. They're like that no one's heard of. It's like oh yes, RT. I swear it's good. <laughs> uh, but yeah, white tea solid. Everyone loves them. Good stuff. Good stuff. I always, I always, always, I, I always like um, white tea teas tea cake names as well, and the, the wrappers. They're fun. It's not really related to the tea quality itself, but like they're fun. Here, one last cup of that 2006, a 17-year-old Shang tea. I thought it was seven, but I forgot how years works. I'm, and I'm old. 
This tea is older than some, it's like the average stream viewer, I swear to God. Hmm. <laughs> the classic, I worked uh, with tea farmers to produce this um, special tea for my subscribers. Yeah, Bitsu, I, I want to do that. I want to do that, but I want to do it real. Like you guys know, if I do it, I'm not going to, I'm not going to half-ass it. It would actually be really good tea. I'm, I'm not going to like, I, I wouldn't do it with tea. It's not like that I wouldn't want to drink myself, essentially. You dear 90s, I mean, I'm a 90s baby too, Anna. We're old. We're old. Okay, let's, let's go on to the next tea though. I'll very quickly show you that 2006 Shang on screen here. Looks, looks nice, nice. We got our little plate of teas here and we'll add it to it. This was number six. Boop. Boop, 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 boop. I'm up. Get out of there. Oh, that's good enough. I just need to rinse stuff off and grab this next tea. 1990, we're so old. <laughs> yeah, I, I'm a 96 baby. I stopped, I am old enough where I stopped remembering how old I am. <laughs> like legitimately, you guys will have the time when I like, oh, someone asked me how old I am. I don't remember. I've gone into that age. It doesn't matter. Like after you're a certain age, it doesn't matter how old you are. Like not at all. Okay. Let's go. Let's go over to, well, I want to do this purple. I think. Yeah, let's, just, let's do this purple one. We're gonna try it off. Cause this is where I poured all the water on. Uh, this is not, I, I like these standard packages as well, but they feel safer. That's our, not the paper ones, they're more waterproof and stuff. But this is a 2012 purple pour. There we go. Let's go ahead and open it up. Question, yes, feel free to ask a question. Today I work farmers, I've been working with my, because it's making homemade honey for bees, ooh. Yeah, because I want to move to Japan, which while Japan, I might do some stuff with Japanese tea farmers, or maybe maybe I would do a thing where I help some tea farmers try to do more artisan teas in Japan. But regardless, because I'd be in Japan, I I know there's a really good artisan industry for like honey. I would love to do that as well. Tell me, am I easy? Is it whatever year plus ten? Oh, you got one of the easy years. Ninety six is hard to head math. Like I, I don't feel like head mathing what what that is. <laughs> I'm just old. What, what evolution is the, um, <laughs> so far, you know, <laughs> I don't know. Most of the evolutions are pretty cute, but I don't know which one's my favorite. Um, hmm. Oh, so I got, well, I got right on three grams right away. Hell yeah. Okay. Here is, y'all has this hay. Let's go ahead. Oh, I forgot to rinse off the strainer. Let me do that real quick. Okay, let's go. And let's see what this one tastes like. This was a 2012 purple pour, whatever. Is it, is purple pour related to purple black tea? I, what does it mean? The numbers nation, what does it mean? <laughs> oh my gosh. I, I don't know if purple means anything specific, but whatever. Did I just pour this? Oh, I didn't, not too bad. Let's see. Boop. Uh, every evolution is a great sign. Yeah, they're, they, 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 Pokemon's done a pretty good, I think there's like one or two evolutions that are kind of like weird. Uh, I can't remember the name off the top of my head, but majority of them are pretty good. He, here is the tea, I'm gonna go give it the bubbles. The 2012 Purple Pour Tea. Here I go, Bubbles. Okie dokie. Now we got to do a cup for itself. 
My tea pets are very well hydrated today. <laughs> oh. There we go. I've been playing, as far as Pokemon, you know what's funny is I haven't done anything Pokemon or directly related in years, but I did start playing Pokemon Sleep. If there's anyone in chat that plays Pokemon Sleep, I can add you. I, I have to remove some random people from my list. But yeah, Pokemon Sleep legitimately has helped me fix my sleep cycle. Oh, 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 I heard someone subscribe. And if you are you, dear viewer, are watching stream, you haven't already smashed that subscribe button, please do so well. Thank you so much, Colt Coast, for coming one to Magical Friends. I hope you enjoy your time here. Again, thanks so much. Thanks so much. And if you are watching here and not already subscribed, please smash that along with the link. You know, all that, all that stuff. You know, do it, do it, do it. So I think it's like here. I think those buttons are like here. Yeah, something like that. Anyways, enough cringy YouTuber stuff. Let's go and drink some more tea. <laughs> You know what the thing is though, as like cringy as like creators telling their audience to like the streams and stuff while you're or in the videos, it, it's actually really important. Like I watched my friend Power Guy, who's a bigger creator than I am. He's he's good. He's one of my friends. Uh, he does like a lot of Mega Man stuff or whatever. Else. But like, I'll go into his his stream with like he has like hundred people or whatever, and he'll have like forty likes. And I'll, and I'll make a joke about liking the stream and he'll get like 60 likes. Because <laughs> the people are just like, all right, I should like the stream. <laughs> oh, it's actually important. People don't do stuff unless you tell them to. But let's drink this tea. I was expecting it to be fruity because I've had some verbal teas. They're kind of fruity. This one, why is this called purple? Someone please tell me why the name of this is purple. It's 2012 purple poor. Why is it purp? No, oh, whatever. <laughs> what does it mean? <laughs> like I've, I've had uh, from the Yuan province, I've had some purple black tea I really like. The wild purple black tea, really good. Um, Yuan sourcing cells, so I'm, not, I'm referring to. But like, it's like a weird purple. I don't know if it's related to that at all versus like using purple to mean something. I don't know. <laughs> I, I need descriptions on my tea. It's fine. The one unfortunate thing about this pack is there really should have been documentation or something on these teas. Maybe, maybe next year, maybe next year. Tea time, you're yes it is, yes it is. Uh, purple tea is a largely fertile uh, Camellia sensius for yeah that occurs as a result of mutation. So so is this so is that what is this what is saying is is this from is this Shang made from from that essentially which is super cool. So is that what that means? Is that what I thought? But every time I've had purple tea, it's been fruity. But that might just been the, the one I had. Tea time, best time? Yes, hell yeah. Maybe next year, uh, I can try working with Lycoporus to get them to put documentation on on these or something. I don't know. <laughs> but that, that's a year from now. That's it's so much work to do. I like it's a lot of work to do that. I understand why he hasn't done it. There, like, there's things he can do to make the whole education package better. Like, I would love to do maybe next year. Ho hopefully, okay, I'll say this. Hopefully next year I'm big enough for him to... I, I would, I think honestly, I would do it as like a, a half sponsorship thing. Because it's more of a community thing, I wouldn't... I don't think I would necessarily take a money on it. But like, regardless, I think it'd be cool to sell a beginner pack. Did also come with like a baby guy wand and like a strainer or something. And you sell as a secondary option. Hot chocolate's good. Do I take two poo animals to buy combined? Okay, how about a cat and a dolphin? <laughs> a cat dolphin. That'd be cursed or cute. I'm not sure. <laughs> here's your tea. It's all about the. Oh, oh, no, 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 Yuri, no, it's okay, it's okay. 
The only reason I told you yesterday, like, it, it, to me, it's the same. To me, Yuri, it, it's the same. I get the same amount of money whether you super chat or you get a membership. But I, I was just wanted to let you know, it makes more sense for you to you get a membership first. Because that gives you benefits. It does also help us unlock more emote slots and stuff. That doesn't really matter that much. But it would give you stuff like you'd be able to use text-to-speech and streams or stuff. I mean, no worries, no worries. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's just, it'd be the same amount of money, like, or whatever $5 a euro would be, it would be the cheapest one. But the difference is you would get benefits. That's why I was like, cool, appreciate the super chat, but you could have spent your money better and got stuff out of it, essentially. <laughs> That's all it means. Now, we are going to be doing um, membership uh, like goals next week for getting new memberships for art giving away and stuff. But, I don't know where, no worries. You, you've already done more than enough. <laughs> no one is required to spend any money in my streams. I'm just happy you guys are here. E. There we go. Yes. So, YouTube takes a 30% cut from the Super Chat for memberships. If you technically, I wonder if it maps out how merch is different if they're, mm, I guess Super Chat is probably still better than merch, but it's fine. It's fine. Technically, I think you can directly tip for stream elements or stream laps or whatever. I wouldn't worry about that. I, I would not worry about it. Let's have some tea. I care more about you guys being here than like trying to ring you guys out of ring money out of you guys or something. I don't know. I'm far more worried about growing uh, um, the community right now than anything else. Um, cheetahs and lions and sharks are your favorites. Uh, do you also know that you can give them? Yes, I do know, Zach. I do know about the 10 free memberships. I'm going to be giving out the 10 free memberships next week during the 7... So, next next Friday, we're going to be celebrating 7k... Well, that's the whole week. We're going to be celebrating 7,000 um, 7, subscribers, 7,000 magical friends. And I'll give out my 10 for the month for next week. Let's see. Oh, oh! I, I see an alert there. Is that a subscribe? Wait, go tell go to my... Oh, thanks so much! I'll run Rev for becoming a magical friend. I hope you enjoy your time here. Oh, so you guys, if any of you guys have not already checked out my Discord, because I'm going to give me an exclamation point Discord. We'll hang out there as well. I think we're going to go on to the next tea as well after I drink this cup. Mm -hmm. I think we'll go on to the next tea. Hot. All right. Let's got that. Let me go and show you what's tea. There, I got it so much for the command. Here is the tea after like, I think it was like three or four or whatever fusions. I don't know. I was not keeping track. It was good though. It wasn't, it didn't really particularly stand out, but it was really smooth. I think the thing I'm noticing from these older Shangs is they're really easy to drink. Like I could drink that all day. It doesn't stand out to me as much as like, part of the reason why I like black teas is how strong their flavor is. But shanks are good too. The shanks to me still are kind of closer to like, they're still closer to like green teas to me. Cause that's kind of how they start, I believe. I don't know, it doesn't really matter. Let's go ahead and grab this next one. Boop, let's put on the, put on the plate. Boop, boop. It's still, holy crap. We did a bunch of infusions that's still mostly intact. Like it didn't really fully open up at all. Thing, <laughs> I got a lot of flavor out of that though. We'll have to fully explore all that at some other time, maybe. But we do need to move on to the next tea, which we can do. There's three more teas. How about this one? This is the package is a little wet, but it's fine. Um, 2015. Uh, it's a shame. I can't read that, but. This is the next one we'll do. Okie dokie. Okay, let's rip this open. 
I should actually rinse off the guy one first. King Cobra is your favorite snake? Yee. But yes, definitely do get over to the Discord if you're not already on there. Hell yeah. Here, rinse off that. Uh, let me rinse off this. Well, I've not rinsed off the plate. I'll read your message in a second. Uh, you want me to make a cat pun? Oh, you can make a cat pun right now. Or is that what you're saying? Kimberly, you want to... Are, are you getting punny with me? Or... I'm confused. Let's rinse off the strainer. Okay. Need to rinse off, dry my hand off. Oh, no, oh, it's still kind of wet, but whatever. We'll, we'll manage. We'll manage. Oh, gotta open this damn package. Ah, oh, there we go, got open. Oh, these are kind of all falling apart. So we're gonna just gonna shake it onto the scale. Again, we're gonna go for around three grams. And these are already kind of like, basically loose leaf. Cause they got broken up so much. That's two grams. They're not compressed at all. Oop. They might be compressed before they're put into bags, but I don't know. I would assume because it's a shang, it must have been compressed at some point. But this point is just, it's basically just loose leaf. Let me just show you guys. Oop. There you go. There's section on Discord. Uh, oh, if you want to post, um, yeah, you can post your, uh, there's a post your art here on my Discord section called post your art. Feel free to post it there. Ye. Love to see it. Love to see it. Okay. Let's go dump that out. Let's go do our first rinse and give it to Bubbles. Don't touch the blue fire stove. I will try not to. I'll try not to. There we go. Let's get, let's do our rinse. Yeah. Got. Here we go, Bubbles. Time for your tea. I feel like I always just drink so much tea whenever I do these like crazy amounts of tea sampling. But it's fun. It's fun. It's fun. You, you can make it now, Kimberly. No reason not to make it now. You can just draw it while you watch. We still have three T's to work our way through. I guess this T stream might be a little longer than usual, but that's fine. We have three, well, there's this T and two more after this to finish all the T's. There we go. Well, here is our 2015, I'll put the name up again. It's uh, this one. Yeet. Got a nice color on that. Let me take a sip. Oh, I've had one. I've had a tea like this before. It's a tiny bit spicy. I, I can't remember what what tea that was. I had um, for white two tea. It was, it was on the sampler. I had a hint of spiciness into it, which is very interesting. I don't know if this is from the same area that had the other spicy tea from white tea. Is there anyone here who is subscribed to White to Tea and also knows what I'm talking about? It was like maybe three or four months ago. I don't remember. They had in their tea club, they had this like three different packs of different spice. It's like it was weirdly spicy, but I was working on the Green Demon for stream. Oh, nice. I look forward to seeing it. Hell yeah. Like there's like not spicy like isn't hot spicy as like spices. I don't commonly s taste this flavor in teas, but like it's not it's also not my first time. It's not the first time I've had this flavor. Hmm. Uh, if you go through my if you go through my my live stream tea streams things, there I have a live stream for tea where I I did all in the, the whole tea club. I also uh. 
had dedicated stream for the spicy tea one. It was like a little bit afterwards. Yeah, yeah, like, yeah, I did it. I did. I had it twice. I had it once as part of Tea Club, and another time I had it like a dedicated stream. And yeah, it was just like this is reminding me a lot of that, which is really weird. Because I thought that the spicy tea was like not completely processed or something. I don't remember where that tea was from. <laughs> this this is this is where I wish I ha I was big enough where I could yell to the void, and the void to yell back at the correct answer. Like if you're big enough, you'll have someone who knows the answer to a question like that. <laughs> like oh, or if I had like someone who, if I was big enough where I ha I literally had people who also bought into the white two tea club, they would know. But like, it's fine. I'll get there someday. But like, it's not as spicy as those teas, but like, that's the only way I can describe this. It's so weird. I never thought I would get this flavor out of a shank. <laughs> and I, I think I remember it talk, like, I, I can actually, let me grab it. I think I know where it is in my, my stuff. It was, uh, I think it's here, hold on, is it this? No, it's not that. I think it's this. Ah. Uh, it was, uh, here, I got them. I don't, I don't, oh, actually, I think the paper, I have the paper says where it's from too, I think. Okay, so we had this on stream a while ago. So it was uh, some, some three different grades of Hecha. So we had, we had one, we're not drinking this right now. But this is our tea I've had that's like weirdly spicy too. And there was like three and there were various levels of how much completely processed it was. I believe Hecha's not generally like consumed or like sold, but, or something like that. But if we go to, I, I have the little document for this. I think it did say where it was made. I wonder if it's the same place. I'll see. Let's see, I'll see. Uh, ba da ba da ba da Hetcha! Hetcha is not a thing you actually buy! Simply press into Fuzon, uh, Fuzons or other shapes! Um... I don't see it mentioning where it's from... ...at all. Now... It, it's just like part of the process, like you don't completely process it to... Well, that does not help, but <laughs> if, I don't know, if you guys can try to, I, I, I'm not, I'm not going to read this all, but maybe it's possible for you to read it. If you really pause it, I will just like, you know, let me try to get this, give you guys a fighting chance. I'm trying to, eh, here. No, no. If someone wants to pause the, uh, the VOD, there, it says the information on there. I don't know. Let's go. We'll go back to the actual tea. A realistic or cartoonish? You can do it either way. Uh, let me go ahead and put. The, <laughs> let me put that. Now we're done being distracted by that tea. Let me go put this away. I, I had like this packed away. We had to venture drink through this, but again, I have a decent amount of tea, but like I'm not crazy. Where I, I don't have like three, four kilos of tea. I I think I have under a kilo of tea at a given time. But, you know, let's go put this back. Um, one, three. Okay, <laughs> That side quest is done. That side quest is done. Oop, people don't like that. Unfortunate. We're going to continue drinking this tea, though. We're going to continue drinking this tea. We have two more teas to drink, by the way. So let's, let's finish this one and get you on to the next one. Yeah, it's... Someday we'll get to there. I think cartoon... Uh, I, did I answer your question, Kimberly? Uh, go for cart cart cartoonish. Tea is life indeed. But I do like I'm starting to like associate flavors like I don't necessarily I can't necessarily name it 
But I, I feel like, oh, I've had that flavor before. We're going to have one more of these, and then I'm going to refill this teapot. For the third time! We won't finish the third teapot, but it, there's not enough here to complete the last two teas. So we're going to do this last infusion of this spicy tea. It's 2015. Mm-hmm. Don't know why it's a little spicy. Still strange. Maybe it's mold. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> Imagine if it's like pesticide I'm tasting. Like, ooh, the pesticide is spicy. <laughs> I hope it, I hope what I'm tasting is not pesticides. <laughs> like, did I learn what the taste of that specific pesticide is? <laughs> I hope that's not it. It's probably not. It would be a good explanation, but... <laughs> oh, that's the thing with having these, like, blind boxes of teas. I don't... No. I'm sure Liquid Porous doesn't have terrible sources for its teas, but... I think some of his teas donated, so... For this look meeting. There we go. Let's go ahead and rinse our stuff off and get to the next tea. Rinsey, rinsey. That's... <laughs> yeah, I, I, I'm, I don't know. I hope that's not the reason why it's spicy. Welcome, welcome back. Uh, welcome back, uh, Jalen. We're just about to start another tea. We have two teas left. We just... We gotta finish that one. Let's go. We have two teas left. Uh, we got... Um... Mm, we'll, we'll, we'll go to order. Now, you can tell where I spilled the water on, but it's fine. It's sealed and stuff still. And so, 2007 Water Blue Mark Shang for from Poor Junkie. Let's go ahead and open this up. It's a little moist. <laughs> Again, there's, there's, there's aluminum. It's sealed. It's fine. I did not spill that much on there. And it, it, there's, there's like, it's sealed with the foil on that side anyway, so it's fine. Okie dokie. Once again, we will do my, st my scale. Pop this out. Uh, I'm going to break, I'm trying to break this in half. Oh, that's three grand. Awesome. I eyeballed that and it was right on. Right on the money. Hell yeah. Are there all shanks? Yes. Every single one of these has been a shank. I thought I would get some shoes. They've all just been shanks. But they're, they're different. They're different. Some of these are really old. This one is really old as well. This is 2007. But they all have been shanks. Yes. I was I was hoping for some... Oh, my, my arm thing's coming off. I was hoping for... Let me, let me fix that. Let me fix my arm thing. I was hoping to get some, uh, like, shoes in the pack as well, like I did last year, so I can get a pair of them. But that's okay. I'll have to pick up some shoes at some point or another. It's okay. There I fixed my arm thing. Oops, all shanks, yeah. <laughs> I honestly bet when they were packing these, I bet that they were not thinking about much other than giving everyone like a fair share. Like they're like, okay, here's 10 teas for you. Here's 10 teas for you. <laughs> oh, I guarantee because it's just so much this whole, oh, I forgot the, I was going to refill this. We need to put water in here. Let me go ahead and put more water in the kettle. One second. One second. One second. Need to refill the kettle for the last two teas. Come on. Here comes the kettle. was a good chance that they just didn't get much shoe this year. Because again, it's a community thing. It's not really done for profit. Actually, I almost guarantee it's negative profit. Like, I, he probably loses money outside of, like, tea being donated. But. Yes. That's okay. That's going. You have a cat with you? Hell yeah. I miss having a cat. But someday I'll have a cat again. 
I just can't really afford one right now. But it's okay. Again, okay, so this is the, let me show you guys. This is the 2007 Shang. Yeah. That's what it looks like. Okie dokie. <clears throat> well, I think, uh, you think people doing uh, Shang Far Less Shoe? Probably. Like, last year, like, last year I got so much shoe. Like, I could maybe go, I'm sure I have a picture of it, but like, I got so much shoe last year. <laughs> I think like six out of 10 of them were shoe. If I remember correctly, but that's fine. I think I prefer um, Shang anyways. And how you doing Vicky? Welcome to the stream. We are sampling for 10 different teas. We're on number nine out of 10. It's definitely like basket projects. You can start, yeah, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, like I said before, that's why I would love to, like, I don't think it would be like a, it almost, it's not charity, but I would love to work with him maybe next year as like a Pacito sponsorship. It's not really a sponsorship, but it would be everything in a sponsorship except for, I, there wouldn't be, I don't think it'd be money exchange or anything. But I would love to like properly help him promote it next year, maybe. Cause like, it's such a, it's, it aligns with what my goals as a tea creator are, which is about tea education or getting people into the tea community. But uh, that's so far in the future. I, one thing I would love to get added, maybe I can pitch in to help is, I would love for some baby, I, like, I think I mentioned this earlier, I would love for some like baby guy wants to be thrown in as an option that people can get. So it, like get a baby guy one and like a strainer, maybe. I don't think you need to worry. The people get their own cups otherwise, but like a like baby guy one and a strainer load helps someone who's never been into it to get to try to get it. Age shoe over age Sheng. Young Sheng over um, eight uh, young shoe. Yeah, that's a, yeah, that's probably right. All, I've had some really weird tasting shoes. But here's the thing, I think the thing with shoes, it, 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 I, I feel like shoes are really hard to age well. He has a mumper measure that breathes them through well. This is cool. I, I don't, I'm not in a financial, I, I, I'm not established in, enough to be able to help him with that directly. Yet, I would love, you know, like, you know, like how money for content creators goes is like, you get to a certain point where you'll start to have a lot of extra money. I think at that point, I would love to help him out. Like again, it's about build, help building, build the wider T community. I can't help it with a yes, but I would love to help like get out. Yeah. I forgot I one is cause I help him cause being an issue. I mean, it, it could be an option for us only people or something. There's also an option that I, you could do where I could I could run, like, let's say, let's say I had already moved to Japan. I could also run like a sister program for it where I can do it from, or I can just run like a similar program where I could ship from Japan, which might end up being, cause I want to move to Japan. I don't know when I'm going to get there, but shipping from Japan, probably be able to hit a lot of places for cheaper than shipping from the States. But again, I, I don't, the year his yearly thing i would love to join in on it i don't it's not something you're trying to make profit on. i'm just trying to get we're trying to get people to know more about shang and shu and stuff like it's, it's an educational thing yeah it's not it's not really charity but like it's not profit motivated essentially okay i think that the kettle is hot like you would I, i'm sure liquid forest grows um what, like they probably get business from people just learning about their shop, but that's not the reason he does it. He, he does it from just like, he wants people. To, this is this community thing. But yeah, maybe someday. And, and there's also like, I like there's lots we could do with it. Maybe someday. Maybe someday. And this was the first, this is the first uh, rinse of that 2007. Shang, let's go ahead and I'll, I'm going to give the last two of the, no, I'll give one. Yeah, I'll give, 
this one to Bubbles and get, no, I'll go to Bobbles and back to Bubbles. So let's give this one to Bobbles, our turtle. Here you go. Boop. And then let's go ahead. Let's do our actual teacup. Excellent. Yeah, someday, someday. I'm working on so many different things. I'm not like prepared to help them yet with it. Cause again, I'm just not, I, I'm not fully established myself or stuff. I'm not in like fully green and you know, but someday. Our, our, our goal is definitely aligned at the very least. Absolutely trying to teach people to high quality core. Western facing usually uh, folk on English style and less Eastern style. Yeah. Like even, even in Japan, like when I moved to Japan, I hear it's better. Like Japan's tea culture is, you can find better tea there. But for what everyone's told me, it's mostly matcha, but you, you can get good, good tea there. And they have the green teas. But like, I would I would love to help introduce like more of the you know Chinese style teas over to Japan as well. It would be fun. And I, I've mentioned the reason I want to move to Japan for multiple reasons. It's in my opinion like the second best place to be for tea, and I don't want to live in China. So <laughs> I don't want to live in China. And Japan is well, it'll be fine. It's hard to get there, but like, I'd be much happier there. <laughs> Bobble. Hmm. The tea industry in like the States is terrible. Yeah, the poor they can do gets less than good. Yeah. Like, there's a handful in the States, there's a handful of really good tea shops. Like Old Ways Tea is a US based tea shop. Really good. They're really, really good. Uh, and then there's, there's other ones as well. There are good tea shops in the States, but like, it's probably less than 20. <laughs> it's probably less, it's probably less than 20. <laughs> and if you go into a tea shop in the States, you're most likely not going to get good tea or even go to a place and get tea in the States. You're probably not getting good tea. Like, it's just how it is. I, I would love that wasn't true, but. You know, let's, let's take another sip of this. Whoop. Another sippy sippy. This is really good. I thought that when I forgot the comment out when I drank the other cup. I, I think this one might be my favorite so far, like by far. This is the uh, 1007 Blue Mark Shang. I don't know if that Blue Mark means anything, but I'm pretty sure this is my favorite one so far. It has like a, I'll, I'll drink another cup so I can try and describe the flavor, but there's a certain something there. Certain something, something. I think it's my favorite. At least so far. And these all were shanks. <laughs> oh boy. Whoop. You know what's kind of funny is I used to do these, like I, I, I've been doing tea streams for literally years. When I was over on Twitch though, I used to uh, optimize more for Twitch where I would drink two different teas. So I would like drink a f two liters from a five gram of a tea and then swap the second one. So I would drink four liters of tea every freaking Sunday when I used to be on Twitch was a lot of tea. It was over like six hours though. But <laughs> I used to drink so much tea when I was on Twitch. I still drink a lot of tea, but like YouTube just isn't really made you for typical streams to be like six plus hours. You're more, YouTube wants to stream for like two hours ish. It's like, there's a little bit of like, like, I don't know how to describe it. Tongue feeling. That's a little more of a, a more interesting profile of the flavor. I have a really hard time. 
what what sounds painful? The four liters of tea on um on on Reddit. I mean on Twitch. I mean it wasn't painful. Here's the thing. I used to drink the four liters over a long period of time. The difference between here and when I was on Twitch and doing it is on Twitch. I didn't have this setup. I was just like the camera to go right on was just top down camera. And I would just go, I used to go to the bathroom a lot during those. If you notice now, I don't take bathroom breaks during the t-shirts. I am a, are you talking about me? I'm a dude. Or are you talking about the shirt? Oh, you're talking about the, uh, you want the, the cat, the cat dolphin? Oh, the cat, maybe you, I think a cat dolphin would be a like cute girl cat dolphin. Yeah. Is that what you mean? I think that's what you mean talking about the, you're talking about the dolphin. We're, we're going to have one more. Honestly, the tea community drinks a crap ton of tea. Like, I know there's probably a bunch of... If, if I were to go ask on any of the big tea discords, there's probably a bunch of people who drink four liters of tea, it, it, like, fairly regularly. People just drink a crap ton of tea in the tea community. It's just a thing. Yeah, I would just... I just went to the bathroom a lot. <laughs> But like, it, I'm in like a little blue suit, you know, like the little invisible suits. There's a zipper up on my back. So I, I can't easily go run to the bathroom. So I'm not going to drink four liters of tea. Meh. Awesome. All right. Let me show you this tea and we're going to go on to our last tea. I drink one liter of tea. Reasonable. Yeah, one liter is fine. Most days I have a uh, half a liter of tea. Gotta got a hold. No. Honestly, I would love to design like a custom like invisible suit. It would be easier to get in and out of and like go to the bathroom, or whatever. Because there's no reason you can't put like a front zipper or something and like a back or ha have the pieces come apart. There's no reason that what I'm wearing can't be easy to get out of. And I would, I think it'd be cool to sell my own line of like green screen suits. But yeah, this was this tea. Now let's go ahead and dump it onto here. Oh, thank you so much, um, um, Alana and Jalen. Yeah, like hell yeah, we're actually we have like zoomed past seven k. I think we're at seven thousand like fifty something. I'm looking forward to next week. We're going to be celebrating with some possible raffles if we get enough to reach our membership goals. Boop, boop, boop. Regardless, we'll be, we'll be celebrating next week. Okay, okay. So I, I'll be working with some artists to get you guys some art. Gotta rinse off these here and we'll drink our last tea. Let's go ahead and put this here. And I, I will actually go back and make sure I can count all of them to make sure I've, I've gone through 11. But. All right, this one was, I guess it's kind of sealed. No, let me cut it. <laughs> it's not, I could open it without cutting this, but let me cut it. So I know I've, I've opened it and stuff. All right. I mean, I couldn't really fully open it. Whatever. Anyways, this is going to be the Peacock Shangpur. Let's see if I get it. Come on. Come on. There. Peacock. Uh, uh, there. Peacock Shangpur. It is Fawz at 6. Another old one. Uh, Kimberly, you're, you're asking a uh, girl or boy for the, your drawing? When I drink, no, I am not drinking eight liters of tea. That sounds unhealthy. <laughs> I'm not drinking eight liters of tea. Um, Kimberly, if you're asking for the drawing, you should make the, the shark cat a girl. I think it'd be cute. Okay, we're gonna go ahead and shake on, try to get like three gram. Oh, got four gram, that's good enough. Too much fluid changes. Yeah. I'm not trying to put my kidneys in hell for, I don't want to get a kidney stone. I think I like a kidney stones. Cause like tea is a mild diuretic. So 
So I don't, it's not actually safe to drink that much. I'm not going to. Uh, but yeah, anyways, let's go ahead and, oh, actually, did I show you the tea before I, here. here again, this is our final, it should be our final tea. This is a 2006 Peacock Shang Pour. Let's go and do our Ritz, give it the bubbles, and taste our tea. Boop. Sounds fun, not healthy, yeah! I can do things that are, I'm not gonna drink eight liters for 8K. There's much better things to do for 8K. Probably. I'd rather do some sort of spicy challenge again than have eight liters of tea. Just because it's just too much, it's too much. I don't know, maybe some, like, chat chooses pizza, or I don't know. I don't know. But, here is, here is that tea. And here we go, Bubbles, enjoy the final tea. Whoop. And we're going to go ahead and get ourselves a cup as well. Man, our, that little plate I have is absolutely loaded. Absolutely loaded with tea. The tea graveyard. And again, I am not going to reinfuse all those again. I did that one time. I'm not doing it again. I regretted doing that as I was doing it. I am not doing it again. It's cursed. Anyways. Oh, here we go. Hmm. Hmm. This one's sharper tasting. I don't like that as much. That has like a sharp green, almost like green tea taste. Don't like that as much, but I will continue drinking. Like, I don't like the sharp greens, is the best way to describe it. But not all greens are like that. I know this is Shag, not a green tea, but there's so much overlap. I like to compare them. Here we go. Okay. Let's go. Get ourselves another cup. When we did our scrupulous stream, uh, probably Valentine's Day. I'll probably do one for Valentine's Day. Like I I'll do a Gartic stream. Wait, uh, like I do Gartic every month, kind of. Scriblio, I, I kind of feel like I need some sort of r holiday to it or whatever. But Gartic is more of a staple. But yeah, we'll definitely do another one for the next real holiday is Valentine's Day. Which I know is not for a while. We'll, we'll do one for us. I'll make sure that I, I uh, it's, it's really, what's that sharpness to it? It just, like almost like a sharp bitter. I'm sure some people like this. The, the blue one from earlier was my favorite. This is not, I, we're not ending on the, on the best for me. But it's so good. It's so good. We're gonna do, I'll do like two more cups of this. To give it, try to give it a full chance. I wish the other one would have been last cause I could just drink more of that. Whatever. <laughs> oh, we'll definitely have that blue one on stream again at some point. Cause it was good. It was good. This one's still good, but like, it just has a sharp note on it. Can't describe. Or I guess I am describing it, but like, whatever. Let's have one more cup. One more cup for you guys. Turn my kettle off. I also, let me let me actually verify that this is the last tea by counting up all the open teas. Let me verify. Here we go, we got one, two, three, four, uh, five, six, uh, seven, eight, 
Uh, nine. And then there's ten, which is the one trigger right now. Cool. It's uh uh. Uh, there comes all of them falling. There we go. Yeah, this one, this one here is is the last one done. Let's have our last cup. The final cup, huh? <laughs> Please don't. Uh, you got the bounce? Like, I had no problem, run ref. We're gonna actually send. Uh, I'm trying to send people over. Let me see if I can act right over. Please don't spam chat, Salen. Thanks so much. I'm gonna. I'm see if anyone I can send you over to. Mm -hmm. There's Power Guy. I think I might rate Power Guy. Yeah, I'll, I'll, I'm gonna send you guys over to Power Guy. I will drink the final cup first. Boop, 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 boop. Go live. Let me at the stream, and I'll get the schedule up on Discord later. And I will get the final, I'll get the final, um, I'll get get Discord on YouTube will be up in the morning. Although the scheduled thumbnail, just don't worry about it. I don't know why I'm just playing. Next week we're going to be making some spaghetti and meatballs on Friday. On Saturday I'm going to be painting the random figure. And on Sunday I'm going to be drinking the IT World Oolong Tea thing. Reviewing that on stream. Okie dokie guys. That is all saved. All right, let me drink this cup. If you guys already smashed that like button, please do so. And subscribe, of course, of course. And I'll see you guys on Friday or on Discord. And I'll, I'll type the raid message. Hold on. Hmm. Now it's not fun going for all these teas. I'll see you guys later. Magical T-Boy raid. I'll use Discord command as well.